I'm doing a positive Buena project, and I was challenged to find a student that inspires me to want to come to school every day and reminds me of why I continue coming to work every day. And guess what? I chose you, Aaliyah! I chose you because you are one of the reasons why I love my job and I am so lucky that I had you since Spanish 1 and 2 and this year in 3 and you are so kind, you are so driven and you're so hardworking and you're so positive every day and you always bring a smile to my face no matter what the day is like. I'm nothing but impressed by your talent as a photographer, positive attitude in the classroom, dedication, and more. So, I've been your teacher in the classroom, but as a photographer, I see you more as an amazing, capable teacher. And you were the first person I thought of, because you're the person who has worked so hard since you got here. Your English has grown tremendously. You are becoming a role model. You encourage love and happiness. And yet you come every day <laughs> with a smile, ready to do your very best, and so you're one of the best reasons why um, I work here at Buena and I wake up in the morning. Oh, okay. You. Meredith, I chose you as one of the students who keeps me wanting to come to work every day because I appreciate your role as the editor of journalism and you are so responsible, you're so hardworking and you're a leader with a kind and caring heart. Um, I've seen you grow and I'm so excited about your future. Yeah, you're one of my favorite students. Your dedication to Woodshop over the years has been amazing, and uh, I want to thank you for making my life and my job of teaching so much better and so much more fun. Thank you, man. But even when I see you, your head up, you carry yourself well, and it's students, you remind me of why I need to be a teacher and why I need to give all my students the benefit of the doubt. So you lead an example for me that you don't, you don't even know. From day one, uh, you put the work in uh, to be uh, not only a good um, example to the students in the class who are struggling, um, but to also put your best foot forward on the work that you did. And like Ms. Perez said, it wasn't that you were just trying to get the work in, you wanted to do the work to know it. Who you are and how you always have just such a positive, vibrant attitude and energy and it's just contagious to everyone around you. And I just, I so look forward to that because no matter what we're doing, you're always just happy <laughs> and excited and you have that cute little giggle. Oh my God. What a great student you are and how much I appreciate having you in class. You've just been an inspiration to me this year, just seeing you move to a new place and become involved and you're very thoughtful in class and you have the most beautiful handwriting too, by the way. We <laughs> um, appreciate and admire your attitude in class and um, you really stand out. Even though I know you're quiet, uh, you make a big difference in our class since it's period. Um, you just really shine to me. And I was like a little bit discouraged and Lily wrote me the most beautiful letter. And it was really <laughs> Sometimes when a student says thank you for everything you do, uh, even though we are teachers and sometimes people forget we're teachers, it just really means so much. Anyways, I love you, Lily. <laughs> the reason why I chose you, Leah, is because you always have a smile on your face. You're so kind. People look up to you, you're a role model to students, you're a hard worker, you participate in extracurricular activities. I swear everyone loves you on this campus. <laughs>